Aloha. <laughs> we made it to Hawaii. It was a 10 hour non-stop flight from Detroit. So needless to say, we are both exhausted right now. Yes. So we're just gonna kind of rest tonight. And then I guess tomorrow, the uh, adventure will officially begin, I guess. Today's our first full day here on the island of Oahu. So uh, I've actually been here before, but I was very young at the time, so my memory is a little bit fragmented from that. But uh, it's Katie's first time, so we're gonna go do some exploring, try to find some food for breakfast, then maybe uh, make our way down to the beach. We got tuna, plum, and salmon. Thank you. So for our first day here for breakfast, we're trying these uh, musubi. It's uh, they've got different ones. This one's salmon. We got tuna. We're gonna try them out, and uh, I don't know. I'm not really sure what's in it. It's like rice with seaweed wrapped around it in a little triangle. It tells you how to open it. Interesting. It's like sushi, but in a more portable format. Pretty good. Good. Sweet. Mm-hmm. So we've been hanging out here at the beach all day. It's crazy how beautiful this place is. It's it's almost surreal. I feel like I'm in like a Windows Vista screensaver or something. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, it's weather's beautiful and we're just having a good time. You guys having fun? Oh yeah. Yes. It's Hawaii. Yeah. Who can't have fun in Hawaii? <laughs> Better than being in a classroom with 28 kids. Justin struggling time to get his shoes back on because he refuses to wear sandals to the beach. Is that right? Sure. What are we going to do now? Can't see it on camera. Justin! All right, so I got the swordfish, and then everybody else got steak. How is it? That was, that was probably one of the fanciest meals that we ever had. So that's gonna wrap up our first day here on the island. We pretty much just hung out at the beach and kind of got caught up on our rest a little bit, I guess. Just had a really nice meal with my parents. And it's kind of weird because like at home, we're both like kind of frugal with our money a little bit so that we can do stuff like this uh, to kind of like save up and go to Hawaii and stuff. So um, now that we're here, it, it, it kind of feels a little bit weird. Like we're having trouble uh, letting loose, I guess. What, we're what just would you say? falling out. Yeah, but everything is so expensive. Yeah, but we're having a lot of fun. So we're gonna cut this off right here and we'll pick it up tomorrow. So we got up super early this morning to shoot this time lapse of the sunrise with the volcano in the background. So we got the camera right there. The only problem is that the birds are like kind of curious about the camera so they keep walking around the lens. But I think it's going to look really cool when it's done. So they gave me a fork to eat my sushi, so they must be able to tell that I'm from the mainland, but just know that I can eat with chopsticks. Today we're going to the Pearl Harbor Memorial Site, which I'm really looking forward to because I'm a big history fan myself, and uh, seeing it on TV is one thing, but actually getting to see it in person is going to be very humbling, so that's what we're doing today. Ah! 
just finished up at the Arizona Memorial in Pearl Harbor. It's definitely an emotional experience and I highly recommend that you check it out if you ever come here. Right now we're heading to Kalua Ranch, that's where they filmed Jurassic Park and a bunch of other movies. Technically the only thing real about this prop is the steel I-beams holding it all together. The walls are the spray construction foam later carved out and spray painted to what we all are looking at today. So we just did the ATV tour. Uh, Katie did a really good job driving us, even though it was slightly scary. And I think that she was doing some of the stuff on purpose, hitting puddles and stuff. <laughs> but um, it's cool because um, a lot of big uh, movies have been filmed here. And uh, as they shoot the movie, sometimes they'll leave the props or some of the sets. And now it's a tour that you can go see some of the stuff in real life. So uh, Jurassic Park is Katie's all time favorite movie. So I know that that was gonna be like the highlight of the trip for her. Sometimes it just starts raining out of nowhere, so we're trying to get back to the car. Alright, where are we at and what are we doing? Hanama Bay and we're going snorkeling. of this footage and it's very hard to scuba, well, snorkel, and film at the same time. Oh, there's an ant biting. I was being committed to the channel and I was filming 
Well, I was snorkeling for you and I got cut on coral and now I'm bleeding. You know, everyone was worried about me swimming with sharks getting getting hurt and I've not even swam with a shark I and know. I've got hurt more in the last couple days than anything. So we've just been hanging out here at the beach. Um, I didn't really like snorkeling. I don't like like going underwater, <laughs> but Katie got some really good shots for us. And it uh, looks like well, she, we'll cut, she cut her leg, so that's not good, but maybe it'll be worth it. What do you think? <laughs> I'm dedicated to the channel. That's right. So even once it happened, I still kept going because you needed that shot. That's right. That B-roll. <laughs> that B-roll. <laughs> so right now we're just hanging out on the beach. I guess every Friday night they do fireworks right here in front of our hotel. So uh, that's what we're doing right now. I think it's about to start any minute, but check out how many people are out here. Today we're hiking up Diamond Head, which is like the iconic volcano that's on this island. Right now we're actually in the crater, so all the mountains that you see here in the background, um, we're actually in the center of the volcano, and we're, we're gonna hike up to the top of it. So I don't know if I ever mentioned this, but I'm afraid of heights, and uh, Right there, it's the last stairs to get to the top. But I'm already like having a panic panic attack from being up so high. So I'm gonna try to make it up there to get a time lapse. Finally, flat ground. Don't whip. Because your chunks. Not to mention, neck splits. Right. <laughs> Are you taking a picture or video? Video. Tell <laughs> <Help> me. <laughs> Yeah. How do you want to do it? So today was a pretty big day. We did Diamond Head first thing in the morning, which was awesome. I highly recommend doing that if you come here. But I would say go as early in the morning as possible, not only because it's really hot, it was probably like 90 degrees and you're in like full sun, um, but also it gets really crowded because the top of it, it's only like a small platform and it really fills up with people. So just go early in the morning for that. Then we did a little photo shoot. My dad took some really nice pictures of us on the 5D. And then we went to, we just got back from a really nice uh, date night dinner. So yeah, that's today. Uh, tomorrow we're gonna do a luau and then uh, we just have one day left and then we'll be heading home. So tonight is our last night here in Hawaii. We're doing a luau tonight with the family. So it should be a good time. We already got uh, some tattoos, so yeah.
did the other day. It looks delicious. We've got chicken, we've got pork right out of the pit, we've got sticky rice, vegetables, chocolate cake, how Hawaiian, and some pineapple. Hawaii was unforgettable. We got to experience so many things on this trip. But the best part was just being with my family. I love you guys, and I hope that we can all come back someday. But until then, we have this video to remember our trip.